Hello everybody and welcome. Today we're going to be looking at the top three Minecraft texture packs that can help you improve your game's performance. Um, now before we start off there's a few things I would like to note. First off I have a separate video on um, how texture packs actually improve performance and exactly how that all works um, and also on how you can make your own texture pack that improves the game performance. So if you are interested in that then after you've finished watching this video of course go check out those links in the description also all texture packs featured in this video will also be linked in the description for you guys ready to download at number three we have a nitro 8x made by frine um, and we're starting off here on the main screen with a gorgeous background um, Anyways, we can just head into the world, and then I can show you exactly what this pack looks like. Once the world is loaded, of course. Um, anyways, this is the pack. I'd say this pack is probably most Minecrafty um, of all packs. Um, some blocks, like the ores, have outlines. As you can see, the sky is a bit weird. Um, that is currently under construction. But, so you'll have to come back for that. But maybe, you know, by the time this video is released, that has already been fixed. Anyways, um... Wandering up on these trees, you can see that it doesn't look too much different from a normal Minecraft. However, many of the blocks are much more simplified, um, and thus this pack will improve your game's performance. Um, and now there's been a really good job done making all these blocks look exactly, exactly, exactly like the Minecraft ones. Um, as you can see when we fly around, the water has also gotten a lot more transparent. As you can see, a lot of a darker color. You can see right through the bottom, which is amazing. Sadly, we still have the bug in which the water fog is really messed up. Um, I was hoping to see that fixed. It might be fixed in the next few updates. I don't know. <laughs> um, anyways, as you can see, the feel of the Minecraft world is basically the same, which is something we won't see with the other two texture packs. The crosshair is absolutely adorable as well. Look at that. Um, it's very nice. Now we can start looking at a few of the items in here. Um, so the parts where most um, attention was spent was the... Um, the items, uh, well, no, the, the combat items, so stuff like swords, um, swords, axes, everything you need for combat, all that stuff, since in, in, in nature, this thing is actually a PvP pack. It is 8x, um, and the thing is that there are a lot of PvP 8x packs, packs, because for PvP, you want to have some really, really nice frame rates. Anyways, as I said before, if you want this pack, you can download it from the description. Um, and anyways, there's much more to come because this was only third place. Let's have a look at second place. Now, really quickly, before we move on to number two, I'd like to say that I'm also actually making a simplistic Minecraft texture pack. Here is a shot of what some of these sets of finished blocks look like. There's a bit more than only what's shown here, but it's not really that close to being finished. Anyways, it is a simplistic texture pack and it will improve your game's performance. So, you know, I decided to include this as an honorable mention in this video. It would be great if you could support me, download that pack, and maybe give me some feedback or recommendations on what I should do next. Coming in at second place, we have Palakius by Cheese Lordy. I'll try and start off in the same spot every time. Anyways, as you can see, this is more, I feel like, a real 8x texture pack. It's really, really simplistic. The other pack was an 8x texture pack, but it wasn't as simplistic as this one. And the simplicity of this, I absolutely love it. Look at these ores. Those ores are amazing. That's iron ore right there. Um... We've got the trees, all the different types of leaves. Look at this right over here. This is amazing. It feels a bit less Minecrafty, but it's so beautiful. 
and it's still so Minecraft that it is absolutely perfect and I absolutely love it. As you can see in caves over here, we've got some glow lichen which have a cool, cool texture. Um, we've got copper ores as well, stuff like that. The really cool thing about this pack is that it updates really, really fast. Um, good job to Cheese Lordy, I believe it was, for doing that. Um, you know, look at these flowers. The flowers are really nice in this pack as well. Um, this pack stays really well updated, so when the next update comes out, you will you can expect it to be um, updated almost instantly. Um, anyways, I'm just wandering a bit more around here to give you guys a feel of what this would look like. Um, and then, you know, right on this cliff over here, I think, is a nice spot to go ahead and look in the inventory. Um, go ahead and look at all these blocks, all the different doors, trap doors, stuff like that. As you can see, not a single thing is missing. Um, all the colors should be exactly the same, or pretty much the same, as the ones used inside of Minecraft itself. Of course, the textures aren't completely the same, but that's fine because it is a texture pack and an 8x pack. This pack, I absolutely love it. I think it works extremely well, um, especially looking at everything like this from a distance. Also, like the other pack, as you can see, the water is really, really cool on this one. This has to be one of my favorite water textures. Just look at that water move around, and now the fact that the water is moving around like this, and not moving around as normal, um, so is this seagrass, is also greatly, greatly improving this texture pack. So this texture pack will improve your game performance more than, f than third place and second place as well, because of minor things like this, which are absolutely amazing. One last thing um, we can do is just go over here, I'll, you know, look in this cave, it is absolutely insane, but then of course water fog and I can't see a thing anymore, um, all this over here, it is absolutely beautiful. We now have number one, place number one, the best pack of them all, that will actually significantly improve your game performance. This is a Mason Pack by Mason Mark. Once again, the download link is in the description, and this pack has to be the best one. Now, looking at these leaves already, um, you can't even notice the difference from normal Minecraft leaves in the, in the distance, but counting the pixels, as you can see, it is 8x8. That means these blocks are a quarter of the size that normal Minecraft blocks would be. Flying around, it's sort of a mixture between the other two ones. It's really, really simplistic, yet the grass and the leaves are still so in keeping with Minecraft that it is absolutely insane. Look at all these logs as well. These logs are beautiful, beautiful, beautiful logs flying around this world, everything is beautiful. Um, not everything, sadly, with this pack is finished, but that is fine, because your game's performance will still significantly increase, and as this pack continues to develop, you'll be able to see constant updates and stuff like that. Um, and the fact that it's still getting developed is a good thing, because that means that future update, that it'll also include the blocks included in future updates. Um, as you can see, I just absolutely love this grass texture. And the important thing is, of course, that the most common textures look nice. Let's say you didn't like the texture of netherite blocks, right? Well, when are you actually going to see a bunch of netherite blocks inside Minecraft, right? Not that often, so it doesn't matter that much. But if the grass texture isn't nice, it's very bad. But this grass texture... It's very, very nice. It comes down the side a bit more than the usual Minecraft grass texture 2, I believe. And generally, this pack has a really, really good feel. And I love playing with it myself, personally. Anyways, um, as this pack continues to develop, I might make more content on it in the future. 
question mark do you want me to do you want me to bring you guys another top three well that'll actually have to be numbers six um through four because you know these definitely were the top three these are some amazing packs prop to the people um who made all of these and props to me as well for my texture pack i guess <laughs> don't forget to download that one as well as any of these packs that you liked anyways once again i've got a video on how these packs work as well as a video on how you can make these types of packs by yourself um anyways for now that's all thank you ever so much for watching and i hope to see you again in the next one Bye-bye.